You have this great community of people around you who are really in the same boat as you. You're so close to everything else that you can have that full immersion into the college experience that you really want whenever you're WT. You walk around campus and it's the same atmosphere. It's, it's amazing. I'm a music major and I know nursing majors and like we're living next to a nursing major and it's really cool because I wouldn't have met them unless I lived next door to them. Students who are under 21 years of age and who have less than 60 uh, earned college credit hours post high school uh, live on campus with us. They feel part of a community. They get connected with other students on their floor in their building. I love my community because I can always walk down into the lounge and there's always people hanging out and having fun. There's definitely an air of work hard and play hard. So you see a lot of studying hard in the study rooms that you have on campus, but then you also see a lot of movie nights and game nights and pizza parties. So it's just a really fun, hard working group. Like you go to the lobby, play some ping pong, then you go to the TV lounge and play some games. Having the gym on campus and the student medical center and um, you know food facilities, it's just pretty great. Everything that you need to go to college is within a 10 minute walk of you. It's easier for them to access uh, university resources uh, when you can just walk right across campus to the library or drop into your professor's office hours uh, without having to get in a car, drive to campus, find parking. Uh, it's much easier for students to uh, engage in, in those success kind of activities. Living on campus, first of all, just through word of mouth. You have so many people around you that so many people talk about groups and organizations that it's hard not to get involved in them. I've gotten involved in, I'd say, three or four of the organizations I'm in just out of people who lived in Founders. Honestly, if I didn't live on campus, I would be lost. It's a lot easier to know what's going on on campus if you're on campus. They have flyers in each hall lobby, so you're always up to date on the new activities and the news. So you walk out your dorm and there's a big flyer in your face saying, look, this is going on this week. But if you live off campus, then you would like struggle a lot just to know what's going on that week. I definitely wouldn't be as informed because we always have events posted on our doors that I didn't even know about. I think the, the thing that's most interesting about our hall is that uh, of the 10 that we currently have in this academic year, the, the personality of each building is so different. There's a real history, there's a real individual culture that the students really embrace for each one of the buildings. And so that, that's one of the things that I really uh, enjoy is that when students live in one building versus another, they take a, a lot of pride in living in that building and they each really have their own personalities and their own characteristics. It's a fantastic stepping stone into adulthood and complete independence. I would say that you're going to make friends and you're going to meet people that you, you wouldn't have realized that you would want to meet.